What is up guys, Computer MD of Gilbert here and in today's video we're going to move on with our mobile editing series and I'm going to show you how to add elements into your um, mobile editor, power mobile editor here in Wix today. Uh, it's going to be pretty quick and simple um, and I'm going to take this series just one video at a time um, just to explain it to you guys and get it through to you as the mobile editor isn't the most advanced thing in the world yet. Guys, WixMyWebsite.com. If you haven't yet, come sign up on this email list to get my weekly Wix tips. If you guys are starting your very first website here in Wix or learning how to finish your current website or just want to learn more about Wix as a whole so you can do whatever you like to your website and figure out how to make it work for you, come sign up for these weekly Wix tips and I promise you'll be happy you did. Uh, next, guys, I just launched Wix Talks, my Wix podcast, and as it says, real stories, real people, real answers. I'm looking to provide you guys excellent ways to learn more about Wix, and part of that is new ideas, and this new podcast is going to be an exciting, fun, and interactive way to learn more about Wix and how it works, and not only just about Wix as a whole, but all the topics surrounding it, lead conversion, lead generation, social media, SEO, all of these different things. And I'm going to bring in special guests and everything. Guys, come check this out. You could either go to wixmywebsite.com and press podcast or use the link in the description below as I'm still working on getting my custom domain for this. Um, but yeah, go check that out and uh, listen now and subscribe so you never miss an episode. All right, guys, now adding elements to your mobile editor here in Wix. So I need you to follow this part as best as you can. So whatever element you put on your desktop edited version will show up on your mobile version. So what I mean by that is, say we want to add, um, we're going to add a picture, okay? Um, we'll just say... We'll just use the Wix Talks logo. Bam. So right here on our desktop version, we have added a picture. Now we'll go over to the mobile editor, edit in mobile view, and you'll see the picture transferred over. So the mobile editor is really just mirroring what goes on the desktop uh, edited version. However, what I want you guys to know is over here, you don't see the same options as the desktop editor. There's no ability to go onto the Wix app marketplace or add anything. So all the elements you want to add into your mobile site, if they're for some reason different or anything like that, you're gonna have to add it to the desktop view. So that means if you'd like to, you know, uh, add, let's see, you want to add a video. All right, you put your video there on the desktop version and you come over here to edit and it'll be there on mobile and then you can move it around in the mobile editor uh, and it's just like as far as drag and drop goes, uh, it's pretty similar, uh, actually near the same as the desktop version. However, you could see um, you have to, don't want that, you have to uh, make sure that whatever element you want to add is added to your desktop version first and then you could go into your mobile version and edit from there guys really I mean I know it seems simple but that's one thing a lot of people have a lot of questions about and I completely understand that so make sure that whatever elements you're trying to add to your mobile site if for some reason you're like well it's not showing up there that you add it into your desktop version first because you can't add elements just from the mobile editor. And then if you did add it to your desktop version and it's not showing on your mobile view, make sure that this hidden elements doesn't have anything in here. And if it did, you would just simply click the little eye looking button and that'll appear right here on your mobile editor. Guys, that is a very simple topic, but I think it's an important one for you guys to understand. If that helped you out for today's lesson in the mobile editor, please drop me a like down below. Comment if you have any questions at all. I'm here to help. And don't forget to subscribe to me here on Computer MD of Gilbert as I am enjoying growing with you guys. And part of that growth is helping you guys grow. So if you haven't yet, 
wixmywebsite.com link in the description below and go get on that email list for my weekly Wix tips I'm gonna help you either start building your first website here on Wix or finish your current website on Wix um, and these Wix tips are really gonna help you out you guys will get exclusive content that YouTube will not see uh, that is email content exclusive uh, and finally don't forget to go to Wix talks and check that out and subscribe so you guys don't miss an episode our introduction episode is already up so go listen to that tell me what you think other than that guys thanks for spending a couple minutes here with me on this video and i'll look forward to seeing you in tomorrow's